in this video i will explain the logic of bubble sort and within 5 minutes you can understand the logic of bubble sort through this uh, example practical example or animated video now you can see you can see these are the numbers and uh, we have to sort these numbers through bubble sorting technique now you can see that uh, this is the array and in this array there are number of elements are there now we have to sort using it bubble sorting so bubble sorting is a technique in which the elements are uh, interchanged with each other if, if, uh, if you want to sort in ascending order then you have to interchange uh, the smaller element will go to the <coughs> index uh, will lower <coughs> interchange and in this way <coughs> the technique in this uh, interchange techniques we do the bubble sorting so in this these are the numbers so through uh, these numbers we will do the bubble sorting so if, if you compare 5 with 3 then 3 is lesser than 5 so there will be interchange between 3 and 5 now next the <coughs> index will uh, the loop will uh, uh, increase and uh, there will be comparison between 5 and 2 so uh, 2 is lesser than 5 now then again there will be interchange and uh, <coughs> next there is a interchange there is a comparison between 5 and 8 since 5 is lesser than 8 so there will be no interchange now next time there will be interchange between uh, <coughs> 6 and 8 there will be comparison between 8 and 6 and 6 is lesser than 8 so there will be interchange between 6 and 8 now next time there is a <coughs> comparison between uh, 8 and 4 so since 4 is lesser than 8 uh, so there will be interchange there will be interchange next time again and there will be a comparison between 8 and 6 so there will uh, <coughs> 6 is lesser than 8 so there is a interchange now next uh, <coughs> interchange will take place between 0 and 8 then 0 is lesser than so in this way in a one cycle or one pass uh, these elements are sorted like that now next pass we will again compare with the uh, 0 and uh, 0 index element with the first index element so 0 index element uh, <coughs> is 3 and first index element is 2 there will be comparison between 3 and 2 so since 2 is lesser than 3 so there will be interchange next time and uh, there will be comparison between 3 and 5 so 3 is uh, lesser than 5 so there is no interchange now there is a comparison between 5 and 6 since 5 is lesser than 6 so there is no interchange but uh, <coughs> then again the 6 and 4 index will increase one by one and the comparison will increase one by one indexing <coughs> increases by one step so 6 and 4 so uh, since 4 is lesser than 6 so there is an interchange there and now again <coughs> there are two numbers uh, 6 so uh, 6 uh, is uh, <coughs> that these elements will remain uh, in their place because <coughs> no interchange will take place now there is a comparison between 0 and 6 so it will go 0 will go upwards and there is a comparison between next time 6 and 8 so there is no interchange next next we have to come to this place again to compare the 2 and 3 so 2 and 3 is <coughs> lesser than 2 is lesser than 3 no interchange 3 and 5 uh, is also 3 is lesser than 5 so no interchange 5 and 4 since uh, <coughs> 5 <coughs> 4 is lesser than 5 so for the ascending order we have to interchange it and then <coughs> there is a comparison between 5 and 6 no interchange so now there is a comparison between 6 and 0 and 6 and 0 so there is a interchange now there will be comparison between 6 and 6 no com no interchange and, <coughs> and there is a comparison between <coughs> 6 and 8 0 and 6 then 6 to 6 and then 6 to 8 no interchange next time we have to come to again the <coughs> third step third cycle uh, the again come to this place and again compare 2 and 3 no interchange 3 and 4 no interchange and then 5 and 0 there will be interchange 
and 0 will come to this place then 5 and 6 no interchange 6 and 6 no interchange and then 6 and 8 no interchange then again I have to come to this place and 2 and 3 no interchange 3 and 4 no interchange 4 and 0 there will be interchange between 4 and 0 now 4 and 5 no interchange 5 and 6 no interchange 6 and 8 no interchange and 6 and 8 <coughs> 6 to 6 no interchange 6 at no interchange again we have to come to this place and 2 3 <coughs> no interchange 3 0 there will be interchange so 0 will come to this place and in this way <coughs> the <coughs> 3 4 no interchange 4 5 no interchange 5 6 no interchange 6 6 no interchange and 6 8 next you have to come to this place again and uh, compare between 2 and 0 that is 0th position and 1th <coughs> index position of the uh, array elements so uh, there will be interchange and 0 2 now, in this way we have to compare all the steps that is 2 3 3 4 4 5 5 6 6 8 so in the bubble sorting <coughs> in this way the all elements are sorted so in the bubble sorting all the elements uh, the consecutive elements are compared with each other and uh, uh, consecutive elements are compared with each other and as per <coughs> uh, uh, ascending and descending order if uh, first is lesser than the second for the ascending order they interchange their position and <coughs> in this way uh, vowel sorting if the number of elements suppose here number of elements are 3 4 5 6 7 8 so there will be uh, 7 comparison and maximum 7 cycles or 7 steps will be there so steps means uh, the interchange between the numbers from it starts from 0th position and <coughs> to the lesser than 1 position of the array. So this is the whole technique of bubble sorting. So I have, I, I want to explain it again that in bubble sorting the concept that, uh, that is the, the concept uh, is the cleared and if uh, this video is uh, informative to you then I request you kindly subscribe the channel for uh, these types of videos and I am teaching in the uh, for last 20 years 6 years in the uh, plus 2 so thank you